So here we have the last exercise of the semester and of the of this lecture on association rules. Well, we're given the following question. Um, we have frequent item sets and we're given the support of the item sets and uh, we're trying to extract strong association rules with a minimum confidence of 80%. So which candidates, and, and we're also asked which candidates can be proven based on anti-monotonicity. Um, well, so just as a reminder, confidence is, well, uh, yeah, the support of uh, one unified with the support of the other divided by the support of one multiplied by the support of the other. That means we've t I've taken uh, the support of yeah, AD implying B as an example here. Well, we basically take the unification of uh, yeah, AD and B, uh, the support of AD and B, and we multiply the support of AD and the support of B. So this yields us 0.75 and yeah. And that divided by 0.75 gives us one. Okay. So yeah, that's basically what we use to then calculate all the values. I'm not going to go through that. I mean, using this example, you should be able to deduct all the numbers that are here. Um, and well, when it comes to the pruning, we have A implying BD, which we can prune with number two and number seven. Well, if the thing is, if A implying D already do, does not have a strong, uh, yeah, does not already not have strong support. Um, a implying BD can not really be an option because well, BD is a subset of D in this case. And yeah, that, that just, just logic wise, if you apply the same logic that we used in the a priori algorithm, it is simply not possible. Um, same counts for B. Um, B implying AD, well, if uh, B implying D already does not have strong support, that's not really an option. And well, if we look at seven in this case, if AB implies D and that does not have strong support, well, uh, yeah, same thing cannot account for, well, number seven actually applies for both of these. Okay, and that's it. That was the last exercise of the lecture. If you have questions, don't uh, oh, don't mind asking us on Discord or, you know, um, turning up on Friday for our tutorial sessions. Okay. And, well, good luck with the exam. <laughs>